Hello, everyone. This is Halzakar of the Black Pants Legion. Unfortunately, Doctor Who is tied up with stuff today, and it's not going to be able to cook. And I have worked my tail off this week and got to punch out a little early. So here I am with you doing some Civ 4 because I thought, ah, let's do something chill. I wanted to hang out with you guys a bit, and what would be nice to do chill? Something turn-based. <laughs> so it's not the biggest uh, rush to get through everything, you know? So, anyway, I'm glad you're here, hanging out. We'll have a good time today. All that, well, hopefully we will. We should. No reason we shouldn't. And uh, we will see... What we can discover. And I know there's... Oh, Wolf's here. Hey, Wolf. Glad you're here with us. And, uh... Let's see. Make sure all that... Yeah, that's all working fine. So, we're gonna... We're gonna pick a... Pick our stuff right now. Um... The thing that we'll be looking at is... Are we going to be doing... Uh, and by the way, if you hear my phone go off, then please pardon me. It's... Uh, I just I just want to have it handy in case someone's trying to get up with me today. Um, we're gonna pick our planet to our Earth type, and then we're gonna pick our <laughs> pick our civilization. So I usually like to go fractal because fractal you don't know what's gonna happen. But the thing is that if we do fractal, then we have no idea uh, what to pick, and so. Let's see here. Hello, Mercury. Hello, Hidden Boss. No, 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 I didn't kidnap Doc and hang him over a tank over sharks with frickin' lasers on their frickin' foreheads. That's not... That don't sound like me. Hmm. Let's see here. No, I don't like that. And that's... No oceans, but lakes everywhere. That's kind of frustrating. Um, I need to pick something soon because this song makes me cry. Um, you know what? Let's do the lakes. Let's see how this turns out. That's fine. But if we're doing lakes, then having a seagoing civilization is not, not really going to be the best thing. Because, yeah, there will be water everywhere, but it doesn't connect to anything. And you can just walk around it. So why would we do that? Look, I didn't do anything to Doc. He's just, the, he said that he can't cook today. So, I figured if you guys were, were hoping to see something in this time slot, I could try and help a little bit. Let's see. What do you have, Saladin? He's spiritual and protective. I like spiritual, but I don't like protective so much. Merka. Merka's nice because Roosevelt lets you build wonders faster and you have less upkeep. But I don't build that many wonders. Washington's pretty cool because he helps you grow faster. He keeps people happier. And Lincoln keeps people happy and you get more great people born. England, huh? Got a request for England from Hidden Boss. 
Let's see. So, Churchill keeps people happy because he makes radio addresses, but protective. Let's see. Group promotion. Okay. What's in that? And then there's Elizabeth, who you get you get more money, plus one on plots with two gold, which is kind of nice. And the philosophical. I'm not very good on philosophical, though. Hello, Blackfire. And then Victoria is financial, so more money. And imperialistic, so there's... You know what? I think we're going to go with Victoria. And, and here's the thing. I, um... And then... Uh, Halzonia. Halzonia. Well, it's the Halzonian Empire. And then... They're people from Halzonia or Halzish. So... Yeah, I think that works. So, anyway, yes. And because I'm a chump, I'm just playing on Chieftain because I'm not actually good at this. Uh, it, it is... Um, the, the leader of the civilization is indeterminate. It is simply known as the Howls. So... Ready for action. Uh, is this a good spot? It kind of looks like it. If I go here, then I'll get... There's a defensive bonus. If I go here... Oh, there's a better defensive bonus over here. Yeah, let's go there. And we'll set up London on this spot. It's not Calzonia, it's Halzonia. I don't, I'm not, I am not an Italian, well, it's not really confectionery, is it? Yeah, yeah, let's build another warrior. Meanwhile, you go over here and talk to these villagers. Say, join us, or we hit you with stick. And we're going to get some scouts going. Hey, they gave us a map, that's kind of cool. So, let's see. We've got a nice spot up here we could go to. There's water and there's grain. And down here we have some rice. There's some cows. There's more coast. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we're going to need scouts. Just get back up here and defend. I know there aren't any barbarians yet, but that's fine. It'll be fine. It's fine. It'll be fine. Hello, Psydoc. Yes, join us. If you chase two rats, or, you will lose them both. or stick. Um, animal husbandry. I could get pigs and ivory right away. Pottery. Granary is good. Let's go and get go ahead and get the animal husbandry. And then we'll go here. How long would it take for me to make a scout? Fifteen turns. Let's do that. Hello, Mace Hughes. Uh, and this is the part of the game where I just sit here and I click the button while I wait for the production to finish. And we will get pottery so that we can build a granary. Any year now, get that scout done. Come on, guys. We're holding up evolution. Yeah, we don't have we don't even have rowboats yet, man. So we gotta we'll get we'll get archery units though. In my terrible god awful accent. Finally, good lord. Let's go here though, because we don't need a warrior. We need a worker. And you get down here, man. You go talk to those people. You see what they like. What do they want? We'll make it... Oh, they gave... Oh, God. They gave me gold. They couldn't give me good stuff. They could only give me gold. Awesome. Uh, yes. Let us get bronze. Alright. Uh, let's see what's over here. Oh, aminals. Oh, it's a 
Well, that's not a cougar. I can't make a cougar joke, because that wasn't a cougar. That was a panther. And they gave me a map. And who's up here? The Carthaginians. Alright. Well, look. If they... How can I best fray? Oh, lions! Lions and cougars and wolves, oh my. Lions and cougars and wolves, oh my. Alright, dude. Um, I'd rather have technology. <laughs> I hope you're having a great day too, Psydog. I hope you're having a great day too. I busted it at work, and now we're here. And I'm not making a Drake reference because Drake is creepy. Well, yes, it's looking a little wild. We're still in the... What's the name of that one era that I can't remember what it's called now? You know... Oh, yes, build shit 12... Yes, let me get right on building war chariots right now. When I don't even have horses. Let me just get hop right to that particular challenge. Well, there's horses. I need a settler to go here. I can get grain and horses. Okay, fine. It is entirely seemly. Um, in yeah. <laughs> Pulled by the sheep. Uh, get some masonry going here. Yes. Ah, they provided me with a warrior. Come out and play. All right, go wander around, dude. You've done you've done good work. Go wander around, see what you can find. Yeah, there were lions during the Ice Age. The issue I've always had with the depictions of saber-tooth cats, though, is that the saber teeth were so big that the cat couldn't get its mouth open wide enough to actually use the teeth. Yeah, hidden boss. It's just, it's just a game mechanic. I wouldn't think too much of, but don't, don't ask. It'll be fine. Don't ask any questions. No more questions. Well, that does sound kind of appropriate for that technology, doesn't it? Um, awkward. <clears throat> hey, we got another warrior. Cool. Get over here. There will be barbarians soon enough. The sheep will rise up, and I will From beat them with sticks. We might as well do this so we can get some fishing boats going. And I think what I... I'm going to build a settler so we can get up here. And that'll be good. And then you get down here so we can get ivory. And you build a farm. Because if I set up another city down here then we can kind of we can prevent expansion across our territory and let's be honest for a second you're not this is in England this is Halzonia so you know things work a little different okay Oh, bandits are going crazy over in Carthage. That's that's a shame. I I uh, I didn't say. Uh, let's see if we can find some iron. We have a settler. Build a granary so people don't starve. That'd be pretty awesome. Um, let's build one here so we can put a mine. Not a yours, a mine. Oh, you guys. No. Oh, that's because I was hitting the caps lock button and not the cap. Not the uh, shift button. That would do it, wouldn't it? Alright. You. I need you up here. Spend some goob to get the next day to be called Calzone. You know what? Here's what I'm gonna do. 
I'm going to go turn on name and game so you can uh, you guys can name the cities so I'm going to turn that off but yes name and game is turned on so you guys can name the cities as we go and name and game from Zira. Zira is already on it Zira, what are we naming this next city? If you speak I need a name from you, my man. I don't... Zira, I, I, I can't. We lost Hal's a Cat on Good Friday, so... Um, there are no pet candidates in this house. Um... Go ahead and build an archer here, I think. It's okay, Psyduck. I appreciate it. But... Oh, good! Well, Montezuma's on the other side of Carthage, so... There, I have a buffer state. Oh, you're right. I do need to change that. Alright, York. Needs to be... Bromel, whoa, bro, wrong e, bro, m e l s t e i n, Bromelstein, Bromelstein, and the tyranny of Halzonia. Ah, uh, that, yeah, that all checks out. <laughs> Welcome to Brome. That reminds me of an old Frank Caliendo bit. I don't know how many people enjoy Frank Caliendo, but I thought it was a great gag of... It was supposed to be a gag of Jim Rome, and then Jim Rome would talk to himself. But then he was in Europe, but he was on his cell phone, so it would be... Rome with Rome on Rome in Rome. <laughs> Samurai remembers that bit. <laughs> Rack <'em. laughs> That's almost as good as my other favorite stupid joke. Which is... Um, actually came out of last podcast on the left uh, thank you Blackfire for handling that with with your cat uh, no it, it well it's not the small medium at large bit um, this was okay <clears throat> the 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 gag behind this one was the um... you should hammer your iron when it is glowing hot <sighs> Yes, I will research mysticism now. The the idea was that, and it came out of their um, their Timothy McVeigh series. The guy was such an insufferable prick when he was in the military that he was the gunner in a Bradley assault vehicle during um, Desert Storm, and he named he he like did, just kind of declared that it would be named Bad Company, and so he would play the song Bad Company which is incidentally by the band Bad Company from the album Bad Company. So it was Bad Company by Bad Company on Bad Company. And then when I was wrestling, um, one of the guys that was on the roster used the name Bad Company. So Bad Company entered a Bad Company by Bad Company. Bad Company... Entered to Bad Company by Bad Company from Bad Company. The podcast I helped produce on a network with a show called Wings on Wings, where they watch the show while eating wings. They watch wings while they eat. Do they only eat wings or do they eat wings and things? Because that's an important question, too. Yeah, the show, the show Wings. With Tony Shalhoub. 
And the guy who would later go on to uh, voice Superman in in the animated se- the um, Bruce Tim Paul Dini animated series in Justice League. Nature herself has imprinted on the minds of What was the airline called? Years. I don't know. It wasn't an airline. It was just an airport, wasn't it? It was just a local airport, right? I didn't watch much Wings. Like, I, I, what... Well, we'll go ahead and build Stonehenge. So we can have a henge. You know what you can do with a henge? No, neither do I. All right, what are we gonna put? I guess we gotta put a village here. We'll put a vi well. It starts as a hamlet, I guess. Half dozen wrestling podcasts on the network. They need a show where they drag drag queens to discuss wrestling villains. I got to tell you, Samurai, the, the wrestling podcast landscape is so, so full. It's hard to, it might be a hard sell to get another wrestling podcast out there. Because, uh, oh, someone beat me to Stonehenge. Ah, well, it's fine. Who cares? <laughs> you can tell Midsummer and Men are <laughs> Well, the nice thing it does in this game is it gives you, uh, it automatically builds a monument in all of your towns, which increase your culture reach. And if it does that, then you have, uh, you know, wider range. Horses! You take a warrior with you, and... Hmm... You want me to build there, but I could build there. That would be here, 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 here. That's a pretty efficient spot. We're going to go to that one. We're on it. <clears throat> okay. Well, no, Aiden, I am not. Um, that is for Sunday evening. That's when WBPLW happens. And I would feel, maybe some at some point down the line, I'll do like a, well, this is going to be a deep cut, but I'll do like a WCW Worldwide thing where it's just doing like lower card matches and that sort of stuff. But, but for now, I'm not going to. Oh, do we have another name in game for, for naming this other place? Because I like the icon, Aiden. I like the icon, so I left it there. Huh? Huh? I like it. You know what? You like it, too. Now, hey, Samurai, Ron Simmons was not a lower card guy. Ron Simmons was was the man. And so, it would be, it would be matches like Barry Horowitz versus Liz Mark Jr. Oh, get some Ox members in there? I'll need to build it out a little more. Um, build out an ox roster, I suppose. Hey, do we have a name in game for the new city? If you want to spengube, name in game for new city. For new city. I will enunciate eventually. Ox needs a martial arts version. Are you making... Aiden, what are we naming this city? Would that be like the auxiliary version? New Old Town. Got it. But he put it in caps, so it has to be... New Old Town! And build a granary. So people don't starve. Well, I mean, if you're gonna... If you're gonna type it like that, then I have to shout it that way. I don't really have a choice. Alright, we will discover maths. As Jeremy Clarkson says. And you will catch the fish. Oh, I really should rename London.
Oops. It's Halzalon. Uh, yes, build a road to New Old Town! And eventually we will make... If we make a another New Old Town, then it will be New New Old Town! And then it will become... This will become... Old New Old Town! Uh, I do want to have a barrack so that I can train my guys. That's pretty nice. Uh, what do we need to do here? We will... Yeah, we'll go ahead and make a mine. What, Iden? <laughs> I don't have reverb equipment, DJ Day. I can't help that. No, old town. That's just me waving my hand in front of my face for an effect. How's that sound? Ah, uh, yeah, sure. That's fine. Oh, cool. We got the granary. Let's get a monument. Hello, silicone. All right. We are going to need food here. So we will make a farm for New Old Town! Um, no thank you, Montezuma. I don't, um, what's the word I'm looking for here? Trust you. Trusting people? That, that takes a little far. <laughs> hey, look. <laughs> what's going on? Yeah. Oh, not too much. Just see you're practicing one of my favorite addictions. So yeah. I'm, to pop in. I'm trying to remember the stuff you had told me about it. So, um, <laughs> of, of course, chat is naming the town. So we have to make sure that we get all those proper. And then... Indeed, I, I, I have heard the capital letters being spoken. <laughs> I've actually been ghosting here for a little while, just watching. Oh, okay. I I didn't uh, I didn't hear you enter the channel, so. Yeah, I know that was intentional. <laughs> well, also I, I have streamer mode turned on, so there's no sounds that come out of uh, Discord when I'm doing stuff. All right, need a settler, and we'll put a barracks up here. And we will just make you generally stronger because you're going to travel to the new location wherever we put him. Now, and there are two settings you can turn on that make things a little easier for yourself. Um, is that the auto improvement thing? No. Okay. What would those be? Seeing the grid. Okay. Which is actually down on the map. Is it really? It's the the square grid right beside the helmet, right above the map, on the bottom right. Aha, this. I can usually kind of tell the grids by their spacing and stuff. And then I don't remember where the other one is that shows you the value of everything and what the um, that one resources are. Is it? Is yes. It, okay. Okay. But there's one that shows you, like, this has coal, this has cotton, this has... Oh, really? Yes. Um, well, I haven't discovered any coal, and I've got iron here, but it's not... Yeah, but it actually has a marker that shows iron that hangs up over at that point. Huh. Interesting. Let uh... me get into mine, and I'll check where it is. All right. Sounds good to me. But... It makes it so much easier as far as guessing what's actually there. Oh, it just tells you outright? That is nice. Yep. There, build that there. Now, it doesn't tell you if you don't have the technology to know that material yet. Okay. Oh, oh, silicone hit a positive share. 
Some of my oldest friends are visiting this weekend, having an old school land party and nerd get together. Grilled meat, hell divers, Arkham Horror, one shot RP games on the agenda. Dude, that sounds pretty. That sounds pretty. Oh bad. yeah, that sounds incredibly uh, yes, fun. Yes. Yes. The last time that we did a full bore thing like that, that I can remember, like an all day, all night rager kind of thing, and quote unquote rager. Um, might have been Parallax's bachelor party. Now that I think on it, and that's that's only been a minute, so. Um. Yeah, we'll do that one. I think. Last time I did something like that, I was still in college. We we did uh, that a little more after. Well, okay, so we had. We had one friend who wanted to do that for his bachelor party. And he got married before Parallax did. And then Parallax wanted to do it. And we'd had a... You know, in the era before we had done things like buy houses and have kids. We'd had a, a, a couple of weekends where it was, you know... We're getting together this week, this weekend and playing tabletop stuff. Which now we have to chop up into bite-sized pieces. Alright. Well, most of my gaming buddies live in other states. Ah. Uh, Some live on other continents. I can understand how that would... Um, well, it's nice to have technology help uh, carry that load. When you can coordinate the times, right? Yeah. All right, let's see. We've done that. We've done that. We've done that. Oh, no. I remember in college we had land parties where, well, we took over the whole college, uh, one, one of the science uh, labs. And we filled up a whole super map of Red Alert Command and Conquer. Oh, cool. Back when that was the new hotness and Civ... Well, we had Civ 2, that, and um, the original, um, oh, what you call it? StarCraft. Oh, okay. Those were just new. Those were brand new. Well, yeah, those, the, yeah. That, yeah, that time frame, yeah. I remember, um... Let me get... Okay, alright. Chat! We need a name! They're talking about playing some Arkham Horror, which was always fun. I did want to have one of my... Oh! Uh, Titicus has a name for us. Herbs. Okay. All right, and we'll build a granary here because I'm of the opinion that food is good. Oh, hello, Inkins. What have you guys got? Oh, we're the same as me. We have no governance um, technology yet. You know what? We're going to go ahead and build the Great Wall. We're just going to go ahead and do that. That'll be a good thing to do, I think. Well, we found a worker, but I don't think he's going to make it back safe. Well, best of luck, dude. You got 20 turns. Hope you don't die. Yeah, that's often the best way to tell them. <laughs> oh, Psyduck, I am not going to name... I am not going to name my capital Sting. Because that's... Uh-oh. Oh. Well, he gacked my scout. Jerk. They like to do that. They do. Ah, oh, you jerk! Gacked my scout again. Um, Production out of and They're awful house. close to your homeland there. Well, they're barbarians, so... If they get here, I have I have stout more stout um, units to deal with that. 
let's go over here. Now, oh, okay. I, I will also um, it is the little yellow right beside the globe on the far right of that same line. Oh, ho, ho. Yes, indeed. Ah, there. We are getting clams. Okay. All right. Seeing resources like that makes things easier sometimes. Sometimes it does, yes. Especially when some of the resources blend with some of the other color palettes, and you can't tell, is that really that, or is it something else? Mm-hmm. All right, hang on just a second. I gotta take my holster off. All right, there we go. Uh... Oh, yeah, I am on standby today. Oh, yeah, waiting on things. Well... Son got uh, called into jury duty. Oh, ho, ho. Um, which is a first for him. Mm hmm And Cookie is asleep. I find one of those preferable to the other. I enjoy both, actually. <laughs> In all of my, you know, I'm... In my 40 plus years, I have never been called for jury duty. I have several times, but I haven't been placed on one in a very long time. Mm. Mostly because I know most of the attorneys in town. They go, uh, no, I know him. Yeah, yeah can't can't do that. Go oh, on. no, it's that they know that I'll question everything that they're questioning. <laughs> I wish... Uh, I'm 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 lo also looking over at chat and remembering, I was always really bad at StarCraft. I don't know why, but I was really, really bad at StarCraft. It's it, no matter how much that I would try and do, and how much I would try and and sort out with it and everything, I was just continuously bad at it. I never could wrap my head around it for some reason. That's, oh, whereas, that's, that's kind of what I expected to happen over there. I miss I miss playing it at the level I used to in college. I don't think... Even when I'm playing tournaments and winning, you know, second, third place and stuff, which I still do some, I'm not doing to the level I was in college with StarCraft. Yeah, it's, uh... Okay, I've got an Axeman who's going to be here before he reaches any improvements. So you're going to go down there and build another farm. Yeah, if there had been eSports back in the mid to late 90s, I probably would have capped in my college team. My name is Ozymandias, King of Kings. I was kind of fixated on, when I was in college, fixated on a particular game that I never did get very good at. Which one? Uh, it was a Half-Life mod called Firearms. Ah. And it was packed to the gills with real, you know, real firearms. That They did a really good job making all of them feel distinct and separate, and have separate roles, and all that sort of stuff, and Psydock is having, like, nostalgia triggers at me saying that. Um, Alright, Great Wall! Build the Great Wall! Brrrring. You know, there were, there were all kinds of different weapons, and they had all kinds of different roles, and it was, it was really good for that. It's just, when it comes to FPS, I am not the best. Uh, whereas, I am probably the only person in the Legion, and especially on WBPL 76, that has streamed and well streamed PUBG. <laughs> I have never had and, interest in PUBG, so I And I, I average uh, 6 to 1 mm -hmm. KD. That's These are on my average. I have every reason to believe that's good, but without having the specific knowledge of the game. <laughs> Six kills on other players for every one death. Yeah, but in the scale of, of PUBG, um, like, you know, it, it kind of scales differently depending on what the game is. 
Well, every every one of these you drop with a hundred other people, and it's one person wins. Ah, okay, it's it's that style. Got it. Here, you all, you all chill out in my capital. Good so, Lord, y'all are so grumpy. If you're killing six of those hundred, that's that's pretty good. Yeah. Um, did Carthage expand down that way? Because I could. Cookie laughs because I'll play it. Yeah. And my heart rate and everything goes down. Oh, re oh. It focuses in, right? Just relax. It's literally like, you know, taking some kind of, you know, relaxing, like, Valium or something for me. <laughs> well, that's interesting. That's not what a lot of people, how they react to it. I did, the closest thing I have to that is I played Fortnite before it became a Battle Royal game. Yes. Back and when it was, it was versus zombies? Yeah, it was the build defense against the zombies thing. And that mm -hmm. was, I thought that was fun and, and different and cool. Oh, yeah. I backed it when it first launched for that. Yeah, and I had a... Uh, there was a friend of mine who got it, and he bought me a copy. And he's like, I think you'd really enjoy this. And he and I had great fun building funnels to... Because it's like, okay, the zombies are going to be coming in this way. Build these things that'll funnel them there. And we put traps up every step of the way and all that court, that sort of stuff. But, you know, then it became... What it is, so... What are you going to do? Uh, food... I still get on occasionally just to slaughter noobs. <laughs> Let's see. I need that space. Because sometimes it just, you know, I've had a bad day and there's only one thing that makes me feel like, you know, I can relax and go to sleep. Is... It's a little indiscriminate violence. Yeah. Against people that have a chance at attempting to fight back. Like I said, I was never good enough at um, good enough at FPS to lean in on that. Yeah, cut that down. Cut that down. There we go. Um. Okay, we got our granary built. We're going to build our barracks over here in case we need it. Nah, okay. So if I go here, I'm probably going to get... Sub those guys are probably going to get subsumed by Carthage. So we'll shuffle, shuffle off another direction. Ah, yes, we have Kalendar. I suppose I can move up the religion tree a little bit. What are you all mad about? Fine. God, everybody's so pissed all the time. I'm trying uh, to wake you up. Let's do that. Just figured I saw Hal's playing Civ 4. Uh, yeah, go this way. So I figured I'd jump in. Yeah, Zumberg, you don't see a lot of FPS stuff like. You know, Helldivers is is third person, and it's a whole. It's a very different kind of thing, and that's that. I, I like it better because I I kind of enjoy the teamwork of PVE stuff as opposed to like the the heads up of the PVP. So ah, we found Ethiopia too. Where oh, well as long as you don't come down here, I won't have an axeman come out after you. Hello, Rimward. Um, let's see. Yes, we can build a farm here. We can sustain. We can do that. That's good. I am the Lord thy God. Thou shalt have no other um, God No, because I do not have an organized religion to use. And I will pick up monarchy. And actually, I do need another scout because I need to discover where 
the heck is everybody else? Who's that? That's the Incans over there. But I'm not seeing people down this way. And I don't know where the Celts and the Ethiopians came from. The other thing I've discovered as I have gotten older is I enjoy playing games where I can think things through as opposed to having Twitch reflex stuff. Like, I yeah, subjected myself to playing League of Legends for like 10 years. And why? Because it was something that I did with a lot of my friends. And ah, okay. as, they, as, as they fell off... Then, no, not Al, I'm not ruling the world yet. Uh, as they fell off, I just kind of kept going. With, and there was one buddy of mine who, who still played. and So we would do that. And then, I don't know, I just finally got that monkey off my back. And um, it's like, well, it, the thing that I think finally killed that for me was it went from being strategic moving around the map as the the big key to play to it seemed like the the micro play of the the instant reactions and throwing down fat combos and all that sort of stuff it was like um wow i am both not good at and do not enjoy this so i don't want to do this anymore hello douchebag Um, I think I'd rather go up here than deal with the jungle. Hello, Cookie. Greetings, Cookie. And then... I see need... you finished your nap. No, not douchebag, did you? Douchebag. It's me attempting to be funny. And succeeding about as as much as I usually do, but attempting nonetheless. That's the yes, Psyduck, that's closer. Okay, I'm gonna put it in chat. There. Douchebag. And we're getting Team Fortress 2 talk. Which is fine. I like Team Fortress 2. Team Fortress 2 was a lot of fun. I was not a... Uh, when I played Team Fortress 2, I usually played as a scout because I was the... I was like the objective-focused one. So I'm like, let me go get the... Let me go get the thing! Let me go get the thing! Uh, yeah, that's fine. Guys, looks like my time is cut short. I apologize for this, but uh, I'm going to need to go. Work thing calls. Thanks for hanging out with me for an hour or so, and I hope you guys have a good afternoon. Um, it's again, been fun. All right. Sorry about that, everybody. Have a good day.